sewing friends. Welcome back to my sewing room. Today is Friday Sews. Even though I'm filming it on Saturday because it's been a crazy week, we ended up going to Texas unexpectedly but happily to see my grandchildren and to help out watching them. That was exciting but it kind of put me a little behind but better late than never. <laughs> I did get a chance to go to Joann's Fabric and I found this beautiful aqua dot cotton fabric. It is so pretty. And it was on sale for $3.49 a yard. So I bought three yards. I love this color. Last Sunday, I posted a video. I did a collaboration with Michelle Sews Again for hashtag so purple to end ALZ and I made an apron. And I got a lot of questions about the apron and, and some of my subscribers wanted to know how I made the lined apron. So I just finished filming a tutorial on how I made the lined apron. And you'll have to watch and see how I use painter's tape to make sewing that apron so easy. And that video will be posted very soon. So make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss that video. We had a great trip to Texas, and yes, I did get on a plane again. I don't know if you saw a few videos back, I was wondering if I ever would get on a plane again, but it went really well. It was a much better flight this time. So it was, I love, I hate flying, but I love that it gets me to see my grandkids very quickly. But I wanted to share with you um, a little thing I made um, a while back with my grandson. I took a, a little canvas and I painted it and then I took some white paint and put it on his feet and his hands. And it was it was tricky trying to get those little hands and feet still. You can see it's a little lopsided, but it's still cute. So it looks like the word love. I just used my Cricut to put the L and the E and put his hand there for the O and his two feet for the V. So I just wanted to share that with you because I know a lot of you out there are grandmas and would like to maybe um, make something like this with your grandchildren. Now I gotta make one for my granddaughter next time I go up. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. While we were in Texas, it was our 39th wedding anniversary on September 10th. So my husband and I visited a winery called Fortunata Winery in Aubrey, Texas, and it was really nice. They have little cottages you can rent to stay there, and uh, like they're like an Airbnb, really cute little cottages. And they have outside seating and inside seating. And they're really famous for their um, brick oven fired homemade pizzas. And all their ingredients are ordered from Italy. It's amazing. And I got to try a flight of wine and we just had a really good time. And then after that, we went to Carava, is my favorite restaurant. So it was nice to get to celebrate in Texas with our son and his wife and our beautiful grandchildren. We just had so much fun being with them. Look forward to when we get to go back again. Thank you so much for joining me today. Y'all have a so blessed day. Bye for now. Good morning. How's my girl? Are you happy to see grandma? Good morning, Isla. Good morning. Hi. Did you sleep good?